Hey guys, Chris here with When Dinosaurs Rule the Earth. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you're old to the channel, welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about the BBC's 1980s TV sci-fi series, The Tripods, which is based on a trilogy of books of the same name by John Christopher. Being a child of the 80s, I am old enough to remember The Tripods uh, being shown on the telly back then. Uh, I don't remember much about the series, only the haunting image of the tripods carrying over the villagers. And I haven't seen the series since I was a kid, so thanks to this DVD box set, we can now take another look at the series. So for anyone who is unfamiliar with the series or the uh, trilogy book set of the tripods, it's set in the year 2089, uh, where huge machines known as tripods have taken over the Earth. Uh, I think they took over sometime back in the late 20th century. Uh, and basically when a child comes of age, they get capped with a mind-controlling device where the tripods control the behaviour uh, and the thinking of the humans. Uh, it's sort of gone back into like a medieval village setting uh, so basically all technology of man has been forgotten about and they've sort of slipped back into a sort of dark ages three teenage lads uh, that are seen here on the front of the DVD box set Will and Henry who are cousins uh, and then the third uh, guy on the left that's uh, Jean-Paul who's a French guy uh, that uh, Will and Henry nicknamed Beanpole uh, basically, uh, they fear becoming capped and they do a runner uh, looking for a place called the White Mountains where they've heard that a lot of uncapped people have managed to escape uh, and get away from the tripods. So this here on the right hand side uh, is a DVD I picked up second hand last year. Uh, it's the Series 1 of the tripods. Uh, this DVD set was released back in 2001 and it's a pretty much straight up no gimmicks release, uh, no extra features, uh, and just includes all 13 episodes of series one. After this initial release of series one, uh, series two never got released on DVD due to some issue with copyright release. Uh, and then later on BBC re-released the tripod series one and two uh, in a DVD box set with uh, some uh, limited extra features uh, and a booklet explaining uh, where it would have gone in series 3 which we will come on to later so I did think about purchasing the two series box set that was released by the BBC back in 2011 and then I stumbled across this box set on Amazon.de and it's the uh, German a box set uh, which is actually spread over six discs as opposed to the four discs of the UK release as it contains uh, this list here of some uh, pretty decent extra features uh, some of these can actually be found on YouTube uh, such as the Blue Peter interview but I thought it'd be pretty cool to get the box set um, with these extra features uh, here we've got some visual effects tests and an audio commentary by Jim Baker who is the guy that played Henry in the series so that's a, a pretty cool extra feature they've got there that's not available on the UK release as far as I know so the green box set I showed you earlier is a two box set where we've got series one spread across two DVDs uh, but as you can see here uh, series 1 is spread across 3 DVDs uh, and the bonus material for each series uh, is on disc 3 uh, and disc 3 again there so 6 DVDs in total ok let's uh, spin up disc 1 and uh, see what we've got warning card in German here we've got a Nice little motion menu that uh, wasn't available on the initial UK release, which is nice. So as you can see, we've got episodes 1 to 5, 
uh, and then we've got some setup options you've got Deutsch which is obviously German language English and then you've a choice of subtitles yes or no um, and there's the audio commentary yes or no uh, the Jim Baker audio commentary so I'm going to select no for now and let's uh, have a look at the quality here we are look a village in England 2089 AD and as you can see it doesn't look like uh, the future set 60 70 years from now and uh, here come the tripods It's this guy's capping day. The soundtrack to the series is pretty. So looking here at the quality, so we can see that we've got an MPEG-2 codec uh, with a variable byte rate, which uh, seems pretty decent, 7 to 8 megabits per second. Uh, and if we look close on the screen, you can see that there's no digital block. Uh, or any uh, other digital artifacts, which is nice. Okay, so I'm just going to boot up disc 3 from series 1 and we can have a look at the uh, extra features. Let's see what we've got on this disc. So we've got some behind the scenes material, uh, some stunts, visual effects tests, uh, a promo reel and the DVD credits. Let's have a look at the visual effects. You can see that those turrets have just been uh, stuck on top of that castle building there to make it look like a French chateau. Uh, there's a lot of this um, composite matte shots uh, and chroma keying. So we'll just have a look at the uh, other disc three, so disc six in the set uh, to see what other extras we've got. So we've got the Cult of the Tripods, which is a documentary, uh, Blue Peter uh, TV special, uh, and looks like a the photo gallery and uh, that's about your lot so i've only ever watched the first five episodes of series one on the dvds and i can tell you it's a pretty slow burn affair uh, there's not a lot of tripod action i did a, a quick google uh, and there were some comments saying that series two has, has more tripod action i suppose we'll uh, see when i get to that uh, but it's a nice little DVD box set, you know, it is pretty dated, uh, the acting's a bit cheesy, but I think because it's based like, like on some children's books uh, and maybe the TV show was supposed to appeal more towards a younger audience. If you look on IMDb, uh, the Tripod series gets about a 7.5 out of 10 rating, so people do seem to enjoy it. So as I mentioned earlier, the, the Tripods is a trilogy book set by author John Christopher and each series by the BBC is based on one book. But unfortunately, after series two and some bad TV ratings, the BBC decided not to renew the series uh, for season three, which is unfortunate as it sort of left the story uh, open-ended. So if any of you guys uh, have seen the BBC Tripod series or read the trilogy of books 
and you want to comment below please do so please check out some of my other videos uh, and once again thanks for watching take care